Galactic Free Press short update. Is December 2012 a real event? Greetings, love beings. Wow, is it getting intense out there? Energies are flying about and information about the changes underway are also flying everywhere. Who is speaking the truth? What is happening? Is December 2012 a real event? Why does it appear the Cabal are still in control? Many are now confused, frustrated, and feeling and experiencing the intensity of these latest incoming energies. Yes, much is happening and changing. However, many who are sitting on the fence are now waiting for others to do this for them, and this is not how it works. This requires all of us. If you are one who feels nothing is happening, it requires participation to know and feel that something indeed is. Our council meetings represent the new paradigm. If you would like to see change on this planet, you have to be the change, and this requires your participation. If you are not serving love every moment by participating in the oneness energies on the planet, the moment has come to step up and take responsibility for your role in the divine plan. Everyone on this planet came here with their specific task and role. We are here. It's up to each of you to connect in. You have brothers and sisters already being examples of what occurs if you are not participating in your part of the divine plan in these incoming energies and portal openings. You lose the connection and will not be receiving any more information. The moment has arrived to connect into the uni unity grid already established. The masters walk among you, asking you to walk beside them, hand in hand, heart to heart, and soul touching soul. Quoted from Earth Ally Angela. And so it is. As the awakening speeds up and the light pours in like a tsunami of love, the planet is finally seeing the return of the masters. They are here and everywhere. It's those that remember who they are. It's those that know that love is all there is, as all is God and God is love, and therefore they they know they are love, God too. They don't need proof. They already have themselves. Thus, they are all they need to be. If you're among those still who can't see them, go and look in the mirror and tell us what you see. Can you see your light? How bright it shines. Can you see God's sparkle shining through you? Do you feel love for what you see? Do you see a whole universe combined as a body? Dimensions flowing through you? Or do you see a face made of flesh and bones? Wondering what you would what you should see more than that. Wondering where all the magic is. It's right there, shadowed by your dreaming. End of quote. The old is dissolving quickly now, and will most likely fight till its inevitable fall. In the no matter what, this is love's planet, and love has won. Stand with love, and you will be walking in the truth. To participate in the oneness energies, you can join us live for the Internet Council meeting, which will begin at 10.30 Pacific, 10.30 a.m. Pacific, on Wednesday, September 26th. We are well prepared to answer your questions, your concerns, whys and why nots, and any questions you would like to ask. From Stargate Gaia has become a Star Gaia. We are seeing beings of great stature, tall, standing in strength, hands together on a grand sphere of light. We have not seen this until this moment. We are seeing it now. The sphere is Gaia. The beings of great stature are awakened humanity. The luminescence of Gaia has tripled since the 99 portal. We speak of the inner luminescence, which many may also have awareness of the of it in the so-called outer. Gaia became Stargate Gaia as of the 9-9. Nine -nine. 
as of this moment, Stargate Gaia has become Star Gaia. Fullness of illuminescence will be attained within a short period, dependent upon the, the rate of higher consciousness development of the human collective. Fullness of illuminescence is assured at this time in Gaia's ascension process. It's all happening for those with eyes who can see. We love you. See you at the meeting, and we'll come with bells on. Love, the Obama.